War on P is one of the enzyme products that we use uh, for urine stain and odor remediation. Um, there are other enzyme products as well, such as P-Zyme, the letter P, and then Z-Y-M-E. Unchained is another one through another manufacturer. Um, and there are some other products that are out there. So, But for now, we're using War on P, or a different, but I guess it depends on when you're seeing this video. But this is the most common one that we use. It's extremely good. You can use this in two different ways. The most common way is where the customer has quite a urine issue from animals, dogs, cats, or or little toddlers learning their 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 learning how to go potty, and they have accidents, or maybe it's someone who's incontinent, who's an older person, where this becomes the pre spray. This this is, is this is designed in the extreme cases to be used. That that that's all you pour in that inline sprayer jug is just full of this. And then it comes out one part this, four parts water as the dilution ratio. Or if you're using an electric sprayer or a pump up sprayer and you need a ready to use product, it's not gonna be further diluted. You do, because those containers have about two and a half gallons of water, the, the sprayers that we have, and you'll see that, you would use about maybe three quarters of a gallon of this and then the rest of it's water in that two and a half to two seventy two point seven five gallon container. Mix it a little bit, shake it a bit. Now you have the right dilution ratio. You would spray this on the car, on, on the on the urine stains pretty heavily. Spray it pretty heavily, shh, real good. And then as a general spray, hit another spot. Shh. General spray, another spot. The reason also as general spray, general pre spray, is that the dog may have gone potty, and then stepped in that spot, and it kind of walks around the carpet, right? So the contamination is on the fibers, but not in the fibers in those other areas. And so I like to use this across the entire room um, if it has those kinds of urine issues. Now, that's if it has stain and odor or just odor. Um, and then it's about a 15 to a half hour dwell time while you're doing other things, setting up the hoses, vacuuming other rooms maybe. It takes some reaction time, all right? And then extract with cold to lukewarm water. Do not have hot water on the truck mount or keep it on the coolest setting and that's the best temperature for pee. Another way you can use this is let's say you have just slight odor, it's not bad, you black lighted, um, and you saw the glow, and you smell it, had just an ever so slight odor. It's not really strong, so you kind of have a sense that it hasn't gone super deep. You'll get that sense the more experience you have in doing this. Then you can add this as a booster to your pre-spray, whatever you're using for pre-spray, whether it's Blitz or BioBreak or other pre-sprays that we might have at the time, you would maybe use about uh, maybe a quarter of a gallon, so maybe one quart of this in the regular pre-spray, that full jug of pre-spray, and then it meters out just fine, gives a nice fragrance, just enough enzyme to do the job on the urine concerns that are like on the fibers, but not deep into them, to the base of the fibers and the backing of the carpet. So as for light, urine concerns. We still charge. We charge a good amount for this. It's a very expensive product, but also remember we're charging for your knowledge you know, and, and, and your expertise. So that's how we use War on P and other enzymes of similar nature.